Oh, thank you guys so much, man. Oh, yeah. It's good to be here. I, uh... So check this out. I was just in Denver doing some shows, and uh, I stepped outside to smoke some weed. <laughs> and then as I'm out there, from behind, this guy goes, Hey, man, you need some sweatpants? <laughs> so he was far away, enough away where that could have been for anybody. <laughs> but just in my heart, I knew that was for me. <laughs> That's just the kind of people that I attract. <laughs> and I said, what? Because I want to hear him yell it again. He's like, you need some sweatpants. I was like, oh, no, I'm good. He's like, well, how about some batteries? Oh, man, I could probably use some batteries. <laughs> There's a beefing in my house I can't find. <laughs> now, this dude starts coming towards me. He's dragging a giant trash bag full of stuff, and it could all be mine. <laughs> He's like, you need a pillowcase? I go, no, I'm good. He said, like, how about a Ouija board? Like, well, you got all the pieces? Can't be messing around with half a Ouija. <laughs> now this dude uh, is coming towards me and I'm like evaluating my life like, okay, well how bad do I look that this homeless dude is trying to help me out? <laughs> this, this, uh, trying to survive another night on the streets. <laughs> and he gets right up to me and he puts his big bag down. He's like, hey, man, can I get a hit of that weed? <laughs> I was like, ah, OK, whatever. And then I handed him my pipe. And then he looks me up and down. He's like. Just cleaning off the palsy with his homeless sweatshirt. <laughs> and he finally took a hit and passed it back over to me, and I was like, uh uh. And then we did that ritual like nine times and <laughs> just got all buddy-buddy with the guy. He was a good dude. I just could not convince him that I wasn't homeless. <laughs> I'm like, no, man, I'm a comedian. He's like, oh, yeah, man, we're all comedians. <laughs> He's like, oh, man, you've been really nice to me, man. I just want to give you something. I was like, well, I hope you haven't already. And then this is where it gets weird. <laughs> he looks at me all serious. He's like, hey, man, do you have some type of brain injury? I was like, does it show? <laughs> and then he reaches in his pocket, and he hands me two pills, and he's like, well, these are for that. <laughs> these are for that. These being two different color pills. <laughs> that being my brain. <laughs> this is from the doctor that was trying to prescribe sweatpants. <laughs> now he's telling me what kind of medication to be taken from my brain. And he gets all serious for me. He's like, hey, eat them now. I'm like, I'm not eating these stupid things. Well, I didn't say that, because that's how you get stabbed in the neck. <laughs> you got a talk crazy back at him, you know? I said, look, man, I eat them later. <laughs> and I did. And I'll be damned, I can feel that brain injury just sloughing right off. <laughs> and the sweatpants fit great, too. <laughs> hey, you guys are awesome. Thank you very much. Josh Blue! Josh Blue! For more 
check out JoshBlue.com. On and on and on. Uh, I said, and it's on and on and on.